Hey everyone, this is Kevin from themathworld.com and today we're going to be going over a trick how to multiply by 11. And this works for any number, so we'll go ahead and get right into it. Let's take 463 and we'll multiply it by 11. Now the first thing you want to do is you want to take 463 and you want to write down the first number. So we're just going to go ahead and write down 3. The next step is you want to add the last two numbers. So 6 plus 3 is 9. Then you want to add the next two numbers which are 4 and 6. And it's 10 so we're going to write down 0 and we're going to carry a 1. And now the last thing is we're going to take the last number 4 and we're going to add any numbers that we may have carried. In this case we have a 1 so 4 plus 1 is 5. If we didn't carry a number we would just write that number down. So 463 times 11 is 5093. So we'll go ahead and look at another example. And this works even if you're multiplying by you know 46 times 11. A lot of people have their own methods for multiplying two digit by two digit. But as you can see here it's very easy if you use the 11 method. You first write the first number down 6 and then you add the numbers together 4 plus 6 is 10, 0, carry your 1, 4 plus 1 is 5. 46 times 11 is 506. And we'll take a look at two larger numbers. Let's take a look at 57,813 times 11. Now keep in mind the first thing we're going to do is write down 3. You just write down your last number. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to add these last two numbers. So 1 plus 3 is 4. And then the next thing you're going to do is add the next numbers. 8 plus 1 is 9. Write down 9. Then we add the next two numbers. 7 plus 8 is 15. You write down 5 and you carry your 1. Next is 7 plus 5 is 12 plus the one that we carried, so 13. You got three, and then we carry our, our one over, and five plus any remainders that we have. In this case, we have one. So five plus one is six. And that's our answer. 635,943 is the answer. And we'll go ahead and do one more here, just to make sure everyone understands. We're going to take four, eight seven zero times eleven so first thing we're going to do is we're going to write down the first number which is zero and then we're going to add the first the last two numbers seven plus zero is seven we're going to add the next two numbers eight plus seven is fifteen we're going to write down a five carry our one eight plus three is eleven plus this one is twelve write down our two carry our one 3 plus 6 is 9, plus our 1 that we just carried is 10. Write down our 0, carry our 1. 6 plus 4 is 10, plus our 1 is 11. Put down our 1, carry our 1. And the last thing we're going to do is 4 plus 1 is 5. So this is our answer, and it's that simple. And this is going to work anytime you multiply any number by 11. So if you guys haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. If you haven't checked out the, the website, it's www.themathworld.com. It's got a lot of cool stuff on there. So, everyone, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next video.